Hello, everybody. Welcome to iPandora's Three Minutes Today Chinese Class. I'm Ching Ching. How have you been? I hope you're fully charged for today's lesson. Although this lesson is not difficult, but still, energy helps uplift efficiency. Well, before we start, all the content in this lesson can be accessed at www.ipandering.com. Okay, let's begin. In last lesson, we learned all the twenty-three initials and the six most fundamental finals. In the order, the same as English alphabet. Do you remember them? I hope you do. And today we are going to learn the rest twenty-nine finals. Well, don't get panic while hearing the number twenty-nine, because after learning the six most fundamental finals, learning other finals become much easier, because all the other compound finals are formed by the six finals. For example, I. Is formed by a and e. Okay, let's begin. I like I in kite, and in Chinese, 白 which means white. An like an in Anna, and in Chinese, shan which means mountain. Ao Like ao in out, and in Chinese, tao, which means grass. Ang, like ang in lang, in Chinese, lang, which means wolf. O, like o in ocean, and in Chinese, o. Which means seagull. On, like on in on, and in Chinese, zhong, which means clock. A, like a, and in Chinese, bei, which means north. N, like n in when. And in Chinese, 门 which means door. R, like er, in lawyer. And in Chinese, r, which means two. Um, I can't find one English equivalent. Repeat after me. Um, and in Chinese, 风 Which means wind. Yue, compound final, leaded by yu. This one, repeat after me. Yue, and in Chinese, yue, which means moon. Yuan, can't find one English equivalent to. Repeat after me. Yuan, and in Chinese, yuan. Which means round. Yun. Repeat after me. Yun. And in Chinese, yun, which means cloud. Ya. E. A. Ya. Formed by e and a. And in Chinese, ya. Which means tooth, year, like year in year, and in Chinese, year, which means leaf, yo, like yo in yogurt, and in Chinese, yo, which means oil, in, like in, and in Chinese, lin. Which means forest. Yun, like thing. Yun, and in Chinese, ping, which means bottle. Yun, from e to on, read it faster. Yun, yun, 
and in Chinese, xiong, which means bear, yan, it's like yan, and in Chinese, yan, which means cigarette, yang, from e to ang, read it faster, yang, like yang, and in Chinese, Xiang, which means jam. Wa, from u to a, read it faster. Wa, and in Chinese, wa, which means frog. Wo, repeat after me. Wo, and in Chinese, guo. Which means pot. Why? Repeat after me. Why? And in Chinese, quite. Which means fast. Wei. Repeat after me. Wei. And in Chinese, gui. Which means turtle. Wan. Repeat after me. Wan, and in Chinese, wan, which means bow. Wan, repeat after me. Wan, and in Chinese, wan, which means mosquito. Wang, repeat after me. Wang, and in Chinese, wang. Which means net. Wang. Repeat after me. Wang. And in Chinese, Wang. Which means old man. All right, that's all for today. We've learned the six plus twenty nine finals together with all the initials, which we learned in last lesson. We're finished learning all the pinyin alphabet. It's not difficult at all, right? Well, the pronunciation of all Chinese characters are combination of initial, final, with tones, which we will learn in the next video. The homework for today is to read after this video and practice all the initials and finals. Once again, all the content in this lesson can be accessed at www.ipanarin.com. Okay, bye bye.